Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the three new Magnum ice creams. We have the white chocolate vanilla, the milk chocolate vanilla, and the dark chocolate raspberry. These were $4.49 each at Meyer, so five, $5 a piece, not too bad. Um, so this one is white chocolate vanilla. It's white ice cream and white chocolate shards and a crackling white chocolate shell. The milk chocolate is vanilla ice cream and milk chocolate shards and a crackling milk chocolate shell. And then dark chocolate raspberry is raspberry ice cream and dark chocolate shards and a crackling dark chocolate shell. Now, uh, we saw a picture of these, so you might think this is kind of cheating. However, um, we're glad we saw the picture because once you open it, it says, you open it, you have to wait 10 minutes and then you crack it. So you're gonna, there's kind of these little indentions on the side and you can put your hand here and crack it. Uh, but they, nowhere on the outside do they tell you that you have to wait 10 minutes. They needed to really put that on the, um, they needed to put that on the outside of the container uh, so that you would know, hey, I can't dig right into this. I'm gonna have to wait 10 minutes. So, we're gonna, we're gonna open each one of these, and I'll just show you how they look. And the raspberry, there we go. So you can tell the different colors right there. And now we wait. Okay, we it's been 10 minutes, and uh, I didn't talk about calories at all. Uh, for the, the white chocolate vanilla, we're gonna try that one first. It is, 350 calories per serving. You get two thirds cup or 110 uh, grams. It is 980 calories for the entire thing. And I'm I'm glad that they um, tell you that. Oh, it's 14.8 ounces. So it, and it's made with Belgian chocolate. So you're supposed to just squeeze, squeeze it. it. Yeah, you can hear it crack. Right, and that's it? And then you crack the top. With my spoon? Yeah. Oh. It's like the old, remember Magic Shell? You probably still sell Magic Shell. I feel like that. So this whole top layer is pure white chocolate. Yeah. And then you're getting down to the ice cream. Yeah. So you get to crack all these big pieces of white chocolate. Mm -hmm. And the white chocolate's on the edges too. So. And it's all through there. Look at the big hunks all through there. No? Is that down in there? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's like well, it a... Well, it's like chocolate shards. Well... Mm-hmm. It's good. Mm-hmm. I like the white chocolate. I don't know if I like the ice cream as much, though. I mean, it's good. But I'm a, I love vanilla ice cream. And that tastes like a vanilla bean. I don't know if I like that vanilla that much. And Me personally, I don't really care for that one. The white chocolate itself, I kind of like. But mm -hmm. yeah. It tastes like vanilla bean. I know they're saying, I'm let's see. Was it a custard? No, it's vanilla ice cream. It tastes more like a custard. Well, just know that it, it even it has, has little, little pieces stuff. in it like a vanilla bean. You'll see when I take a picture of it. I like it. I think it's good. I like the flavor of the white chocolate. It's not the best I've had, uh, but I like it. I, I I think it's worth it five dollars. Okay, no, this one's just milk chocolate. Chocolate with, uh, with chocolate with <laughs> vanilla ice cream. Yeah, vanilla ice cream, milk chocolate shards, and a and a cracker and milk chocolate shell. So I'm assuming there's little milk chocolate things off. This one is 350 per serving or 970 for the entire container. No, this mm -hmm. chocolate works well too. I'm sure if you eat Magnum ice cream, it's the same vanilla ice cream they have and all their stuff. Yes. I just don't like the vanilla. I like that one better. Kevin is a vanilla connoisseur. He well, knows. Good. I like to have vanilla. He really likes his vanilla, and um, I'm sure there's people out there that love that vanilla, and it and it's it's not bad, and I like the chocolate one better because mm -hmm. the chocolate kind of counteracts some of the vanilla flavor. But I don't know, there's something about that vanilla I just don't like that much. 
The milk chocolate is a very, very good very milk good. chocolate. I know what you mean about the vanilla. It has a different flavor to it. Mm -hmm. It's not like a traditional vanilla. Right. It, no, it's not. Um, so I would agree with you about the vanilla. Now, ice cream. I don't want to sway you. But no, just... I can taste it more in this one than I could the other one. Although I do think in that one, it's it, it's the vanilla bean flavor stands out. Yeah. And it's still, it still, I get what you're saying. Yeah, it's not bad. It's just different mm -hmm. for me. Hey, this one is a dark chocolate raspberry. It's raspberry ice cream um, and dark chocolate shards in a crackling dark chocolate shell. I think it's neat that it has uh, the uh, all the way down through there. Is yes, the yes, it, it is nice. And so, the sides and everything. Yes, there's a lot of white chocolate down in that. There's a lot of milk chocolate. You can see where the um, the, the pieces of chocolate swirl in there. Yeah, I try not to. I tried to leave some smaller pieces. Okay, there. this one is 340 calories per serving and 960. So this, the white was 980, the milk was 970, and this is 960. So we're going down in calories. Yeah, you're in the middle. No. What do you think about that raspberry? I don't care for it. I didn't care for it too much either. I was going to think of the white just to see if it was just me. No, I don't care for it. It, um, it, is it dark chocolate? Mm -hmm. Okay. It, uh, so they're putting the combination together. That's a classic combination. Normally, I love that. When I get those pieces in a box of chocolates, I love the dark chocolate and the raspberry. But that, it leaves your mouth feeling dry. Or it did mine anyway. That's the dark chocolate. That dark chocolate is very it's too dark it's bitter it's uh on the back of my uh, in the back of my mouth well it's a very bitter flavor and then the raspberry has a, a strong tartness uh, to it yes so it's it, not it, sweet at all and so it kind of like adds to that dark right. chocolate flavor so I hate yeah to say i don't that. i don't think those were that that one was sweet at all i would not choose that because when i want ice cream i want something sweet i, I don't think i'm buying any of these I wouldn't either. But if you were a Magnum lover, if you love Magnum. There are people so. who watch my channel that are like crazy over the top, think that Magnum is the best thing since sliced bread. And if you like, if you're like that, you will love this. Yes, you will. Because <laughs> uh, I love the chocolate. I love the idea of having the chocolate mm -hmm. in there. And the milk chocolate is very, That's very exactly, good. I love the milk chocolate. The yes. milk chocolate was really good. I could eat just the milk chocolate all the Yes. Um, that one's really good. But if you're used to that flavor of that Magnum ice cream anyway, you'll probably like all of these. It's it's the vanilla itself that he has the problem with. Now I don't mind the vanilla at all. My favorite would probably be the white chocolate. Really? Yes, because I like the the flavor of the white chocolate. I don't mind it being a vanilla bean type flavor. I do like the um, the milk chocolate in this one though. Um, I, I wouldn't gravitate towards these though over some other ones that are available. Put in these sizes, mm -hmm. put it that way. Um, they're good, but uh, yeah, I just like some of those better yeah. because they have more dimension to them. Yeah, yeah. but just know that there's tons of stuff in these. So if you oh, want chocolate yes, mixture, they're, there's cool. tons of, of shards of chocolate. They're throughout. definitely worth $4.99 each. Yeah, you, they're, they're you a good get your quality. money's worth, yeah. yeah. So I hope you can find them in your area. I will take a picture of uh, the inside for you. And thanks for watching.